What is going on people? It's Eternal Prince here, bringing you a let's play of Tumba. Now guys, this has been a highly requested game from my Discord community. It's actually a classic game, which was released in 1997 by Whoopi Camp, which I don't, I'm not sure if they exist or not anymore. It's quite sad to be fair. Honestly guys, I can't wait to play this. Let's get straight into it. guys let's go hey you with the pink hair I've never seen you around here before I used to live here but it's changed so much well if you need any info go to the small hut on top of that hill up ahead this crazy old geezer lives up there where he should be able to help you out before you go be sure to check all the signs on the way the local visitors bureau did a great job of supplying helpful info for visitors read the signs Press up on the directional button and square on the button. By the way, what is with the pink hair anyway? Never mind, I don't want to know. See ya! The 100 year old wise man. Alright guys, let's do this. So, um, I don't know how to explain this game. I guess we're going to have to uh, explain as we go along. Uh, we'll have a quick look at the settings. So these are, this is the inventory. This is what we've got currently. Um, not a lot, but I'm sure we'll add to the collection. Um, we do have a attack style, which is uh, this, and it's our uh, blackjack. Well, okay, so we just got an apple from that. But yeah, and then obviously jumping. So what is the point of the game? Um, the point of the game is to actually kill the pigs, and you guys will see in due course. But what we're going to do is we're going to come up here first, and then we're going to go for this thing here. Clear the fog. It brings us right to the start with the Furious Tornado acquired. Okay, what we're going to do guys is we're going to start jumping on these. Because I think we're going to need to do this later on for a quest. So I'm not sure how many there are. I'm sure we'll get through it. Oh, we've got our first enemy encounter. It's a pig. What we do is we just jump on him. Throw my other pigs. But yes, we can use a blackjack as well. But we won't just use that just yet. If we need to use it, we'll use it. We'll try our best to... Uh, Kill as many as we can. So you can swing from a tree while you hang up from a tree branch. Press and hold the left and right on the directional button to swing. Swing in the opposite direction, hold the opposite direction button. Okay, that's fine. What we'll do is we'll... Uh, I just want to come up here. Oh, okay, never mind. Well, there's a branch here anyway. Somewhere. There we go. And then what I want to do is I just want to jump up a bit because we saw a monkey go up in the tree. Gonna go see what he wants. Leave me alone! I haven't eaten all day and your pink hair is giving me a headache. Colorist. Hungry monkey! So, looks like we're gonna have to go find this guy some food. Oh god, guys, this brings back so much nostalgia. Um, from what I remember from the past, we need to somehow get this pig over here. I don't know how we're gonna do that. I should be really careful. Whoa! Okay, hold on a sec. Stun the pig there. When the pig wakes up, we'll uh, fart on it. Have a whiff of that. Come on. There we go, guys. We've just converted it into a small pig. Now we just need to uh, take this. Whoa! Baby pig acquired. Peach flower gas. That's actually an event. Nice. Um, so there actually is an event list somewhere in the game as well. I can't exactly remember where. Press. There we go. Events. We have a list of events over here. Um, so the grandpa's bracelet. So the point of the game is to actually go and uh, get our grandpa's bracelet back. They didn't really explain it that well, but uh, as this tumba took on a uh, bunch of pigs that was harassing the farmer at the start of the game. And we tumba tried to save them. And the pig, pigs managed to knock him out and steal his bracelet. So that's what the point of the game is. 
Oh shit, it's the guy again. But he went left. How did he come from up there? Oh, heading off to the old man's hut already. Unfortunately, the fog is so thick up ahead that you can't see a thing. Looks like we'll have to turn around. Do you dye your hair or is it naturally pink? Yeah, never mind. But I had my nature survivalist mail order catalogue. Sure, there will be something I could order out of there to get rid of this fog. Oh well, bye. So we've got a, a fog up ahead, guys, and we ha do actually have something for that, so that's fine. So what I want to do, guys, is just for the nostalgia. I remember playing this game over and over again on the demo, and this part used to always get me. Very cool music, and as a kid, honestly, that was just really nostalgic. That it just reminded me of the good old days. So, let's crack on, guys. Pun intended. You guys will see why shortly. Let's jump on this pig. And let's try our best to get rid of this bird, too. It's quite easy, to be fair. And what we need to do, guys, is on the way up, or where we're going to see the 100 year old man, we want to crack some eggs. We're going to try and crack all the eggs get some baby chicks. It'll all make sense later, I promise. The only reason why I'm doing it all in one go right now is so that we can uh, soak it all in together. So some item to use, something windy might just do the trick. And we've got just a thing. So what we've got, we've got Furious Tornado. Scene. But it just blows it away. I don't know how Tombo uses it. Does he go? <laughs> Let's unlock the next part of the map. Clear the fog. Clear. Awesome. That's another event done. So let's jump over. And what can we see over here? So obviously, we can't fall down there because we'll probably die. Let's try our best to get through here. Kill these things. Use against that. Now what I want to do is just want to push this apple down here. Because there's these biting plant flowers. Yep, okay. Biting plant flower. It's giving us another event. We actually haven't cleared the event. It just gives us the event that says that we've unlocked it. And then what we're going to do, guys, is we're just going to go here and crack this egg open. And grab this chick, too, at the same time. Chick acquired. And I just want to come over here, guys, because there's a little treat over here. There we go. Frog acquired. Take me home. All right, let's go. We need to take him somewhere. Let's go up here. Now, I don't know if these things actually trigger right now. I don't want to risk it. But they can jump up and bite you if you jump over them. So you have to go way over them to get them. And then what I want to do is I just want to come this way. Got some hidden eyes over here. What? You found me already? I was trying to hide from you. Well, since you found me, I'll give you a little hint. To the right of me behind this hut, there's a little pond. If you go up the hill above here, you can meet this crazy old coot. He's supposed to be some wise hundred year old man. But he just seems to mumble a lot to me. Awesome. So there's, guys, there's a pond. So where do we take, where do frogs live? In ponds. And we need to go to the 100-year-old man. Who am I? Never mind. Go see the places I just told you about and we'll talk again later. Awesome. All right, guys, let's go over here. Ribbit. Take me home. Clear. Awesome. Just want to jump on here quickly. Nice little uh, swim. You want to get past me? Haha, <laughs> can you swim? Can't swim. I can't swim! No! Haha, <laughs> ha! I thought so. Mr. Turtle saved you this time, but next time you may not be so lucky. You can't go past the door here unless you can swim. Trust me, you're not up to it yet. Come back after you learn how to swim. Hey, you hungry? Why don't you take this with you? Ooh, some bananas. See you later. Much later. <laughs> right, guys. So, who at the start of the game needed a banana? Yes, it's the monkey at the start. So, what we're going to do is 
we're not going to just go to him just yet. We're going to go keep ca carrying on going up. And there's another egg over there. So let's crack this open. Yes. Now what I want to do is try to leave the apples there because apples rejuvenate your health. And we should really, really be taking the apples if uh, we're low on health. There's no point eating apples for the sake of it. And let's go up here. So the game doesn't actually point you in the right direction. You just kind of discover the areas, which is the beauty about this game. Um, it's literally one path towards the end. AP. The AP box. Obviously, guys, we haven't got enough AP right now. We've got 26,000 AP on the top right. We'll need uh, 50,000 to unlock that. And what's this, guys? A chest. It's locked. Okay, we'll have to get that later. Let's go straight in here, guys. Hmm, what shall I do? Hmm, 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 hmm. Why, hello there. You're a cute little fella. Yes, I am the hundred-year-old wise man. What can I do for you? The hundred-year-old wise man? Hmm, oh, sorry. My mind is preoccupied with something else at the moment. Say, would you do me a favour? So you see, there is something that is just really bothering me. You must have seen them on your way here, the red cocker birds. Those darn birds steal eggs and try to raise them as their own. I feel sorry for the cute little chicks inside the eggs. Could you go out and collect all of the chicks from the eggs? Which we've already done. Inside the cocker eggs? They're called cocker eggs, guys. Good job. You found all of them. Um, well, where are the chicks? Inside the cocker eggs? Clear. Another event done. What? You kept them in your stomach? What else do you keep in there? Never mind. You don't need to show me. It's alright, really. Thanks to you, I have one less thing to worry about now. Ah, uh, yes, you wanted to see me about something, right? Mm hmm. So the coma pig stole your grandpa's bracelet. Hmm. Hmm. So you want to know all about the coma pigs, huh? Hmm. Well, here's how the story goes. This was once a beautiful, peaceful land. Until seven evil pigs came. They suddenly appeared and used their powers to change this land into an ugly world. For some reason, the evil pigs seemed to be collecting gold. I bet your grandpa's bracelet that was stolen by the coma pigs was made out of gold, too. The seven evil pigs are hiding somewhere in this world. If you find them, I'm sure you'll be able to find your bracelet as well. Just remember, be very careful. Oh, yes. Now that's all I need to know. That's all that I know about the coma pigs. If you wish to retrieve your bracelet, you should make some friends. They'll be a great help to you. Of course, if there's anything I can do for you, just come back here. Awesome. Hmm, I seem to have lost my 100-year-old bell. I was going to give it to you. If you find it, return it to me, would you? In place of the bell, I'll give you this. An ancient key. This old key is also 100 years old. Oh, time goes by so fast. The key was made when he was 0 years old. When he was born. This is only the key that will... Open the hundred year old chests. Ah uh, yes, you also need the evil pig bags in order to find the evil pigs. Without the evil pig bags you won't be able to find their hiding places. Go ask the dwarf elder about the evil pig bags. Mm. You'll find him, past the forest above here. Mm. He should be able to tell you everything you need to know about the evil pig bags. Now run along, youngster. Alright guys, so that was the dwarf elder that we, we need to go find. That's a hundred year old man that we've just met. But before we crack on, guys, on the rope, I just want to do something else. He's given us a key, so we've come across some boxes on the way up, or some chests even. Now I want to open some of these. And we need to go down too, because I want to do something else. Charity wings acquired. But I thought I didn't want to explain the plot too much. I thought we let the story unfold itself. Now you guys understand exactly what's going on with the game. Let's go straight down. Ooh! Okay, yes, this person. See, I told you so. I hope the old coot was really helpful. Me? People call me Yan of the Hidden Village. Who are you? Event clear. Awesome. Hide and go seek. 
I like to hide from people. Usually they never find me. If you find me again, I'll give you more information. Don't expect it to be this easy next time. This is going to be a lot of fun. A good old game of hide and go seek. Well, good luck. See ya. Well, what if I don't want to play? Um, okay, he's just buggered off somewhere. So we need to go back to the start because we've missed something. Oh, okay, I thought I nearly uh, fell down there, but... Okay, right, guys. I need to just jump up there to the top right because I see some coins. There we have it. I just want to jump to the... Uh, I just want to jump up and get that. Awesome. I just want to jump over here. And there's one more to the left. Don't ask how I know this, guys. I think it's just muscle memory from when I used to play this as a kid. Over and over again. I must have played the demo about 50 times. And yes, guys. Vitality Max. Holy shit. Some pigs here. Ow, that hurt. And there we go, guys. That's our first damage off the uh, game. Now you guys get to see how the uh, healing works. What we're going to do is we're going to uh, come this way because it's easier, I think. And then we're going to just jump here. And let's just see if the fart works. Nope. Okay. Let's jump over here, over here, and over here. Awesome. So the reason why I wanted to come back was, I don't know if you guys saw that. There's a uh, box up there. But it's not just that, guys. Remember we picked up some bananas? We've got a monkey up there, a very hungry monkey, that we need to feed. So yeah, let's, let's just go up here. Jump up there. Leave me alone! I haven't eaten all day and your pink hair is giving me a headache. Well, not to worry, Mr. Monkey Man. Let's give you some bananas. Wow! You give me your bananas? Thanks! You're not so bad after all. I was so hungry I couldn't move. My name is Charles. Charles the monkey. I know what I can do for you. I'll teach you a trick, okay? Press the square button and the directional button together to run. It's called the animal dash. You got it, kid. The square button and the directional button. Well, gotta go. Animal dash acquired. Awesome, guys. And let's just give this a little whirl. And look at that, guys. Little animal dash. And I just want to come up here. So I guess it's like, like a, a Tomba superpower or something. And guys, I just want to quickly jump on these while we're here. On, the, on this side. Kill as many pigs as we can. And remember guys, if there was actually an AP box that we missed as well. So we'll need to go back up and get that. And then, I don't know if you guys can see over there, but there's a chest up there. So we need the animal dash for that. Let's jump up there. There we have it guys, the 100 year old bell acquired. And then what I want to do is, I just want to get 50,000 points for the AP box that we saw too. We can go and open that too. But the, the neat trick about the bell is, the neat trick about the bell is that uh, we can actually go up back to the 100 year old man. I don't know if you guys can see this as well, this is uh, change colour. That's what we need to do for the rest of them later on in the game. I think we missed some, but we can always come back and do a quick run through. But right now, I just want to go back to the 100 year old man because the AP box is right next to him. And that's just a free teleport to this guy. He actually does heal you as well if your health is really low. So if you get into a tight spot, you can always come back to him and uh, not die. Right, let's go down and get this AP box. Two apples? Two apples for all of that? Not worth it. We've just left it. Let's go straight back in and then we can move on to the next area. Off we go. Awesome. Let's do this. And before we continue on, guys, I just want to save. Grug, gruff, nuglub, grug. Beginner's dwarf language. Event started. Right, guys, I'm just going to save here. And then uh, we will have to continue on for the next episode to uh, figure out the plot.
awesome. And yes, guys, catch you on episode two.